My name is Peter Flynn and I am the Head of Academic Enrichment. I work as part of the Sixth Form team. I've been in the Sixth Form team for four years and I've been in Dubai English Speaking College for seven years now. Uh, unfortunately, it's my 27th year of teaching and I've taught in four different continents, in Africa, in Malaysia, across the Middle East, in Singapore and in Brunei. And I came to Dubai most recently. It's been a fantastic college to work in, partly because the sixth form team is so supportive and so dynamic. And I think what makes us such a strong team is the fact that we work in close proximity with each other. I work with Mitchell Burke, who's the head of a higher education. And I also work with Maria Viteratis, who's the head of careers very closely. Together, we are a tight knit team. And our philosophy is to personalize counseling for every student. Students come into our office and they look for advice and they look for direction in terms of their university applications. And it's our job to do the best that we can and to make sure that all the advice they get is tailor-made. As Head of Academic Enrichment, my main role is to make sure that in addition to fantastic A-level and B-Tech results, students are able to add a little more have a kind of unique selling point that will appeal to universities across the world. And in particular, I run the Extended Project Qualification or the EPQ. We must be one of the biggest EPQ centers in the world because at the moment we have over 150 students doing projects. These projects are a fantastic opportunity for students to show wider reading and to show interest beyond the curriculum and they can do it in any subject whatsoever. So we have students doing psychology, law, philosophy, economics, but also sports science. And we have some students who use their practical or their artistic skills as well to make what we call artifacts. All of this EPQ is designed to show, as I say, curiosity, engagement, and passion. Now, in addition to the EPQ and complementing the EPQ, we run a number of subject societies. These are extremely important because they teach student leadership. We have students running these societies. They organize lectures, discussions. They organize the technology. They organize the program. And every lunchtime in our sixth form, you will see talks and lectures going on. In many cases, we have to actually limit the numbers because there's so much enthusiasm. So we have a medical society in which students learn how to get ready to, uh, for medical applications. And each week they meet, they have lectures and they have discussions. We run a philosophy and politics society which is extremely popular, often really contentious, where we debate the key issues of the day, in fact, this week we had an extremely interesting, engaging and contentious lecture on feminism that generated a great deal of interest. So much so that next week we will do a second stage of the same lecture. So we're very proud of the fact that in addition to excellent teaching and excellent classes in the sixth form, you will see students having plenty of opportunities for enrichment. Our Law Society is also extremely well attended. And one of the main aims of the Law Society is to give students insights into what a career in law will entail and how to make their legal uh, applications competitive by showing an awareness of the debates of the day. One of the great things about the DES 6 form is that we are able to give the students individual counseling sessions where we can personalize their learning. We can look at their EPQs and their uh, university personal statements, and we can give them genuine deep advice. And they're able to answer us questions so that these become really productive learning encounters. And this is something that is so important to the culture in the sixth form and so much part of my job. And seeing the learning journey of students going from their initial ideas to finishing fantastic 5,000 word university style dissertations is without doubt the most satisfying aspect of my job and the one that gets me up in the morning.